inventing my greatest invention, the Flintlock. <laughs> Important principle. <laughs> oh, dessert Bart! I've been waiting seven years for this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The dessert barge has finally arrived. <gasps> Butterfly. It only passes by Swallow Falls every seven years. So beautiful. They say it's fueled by butterscotch sauce. The deck is made of licorice, and the life preservers are solid chocolate. So unpredictable. We gotta go. Did you know butterflies eat with their feet? Flint. Are you even listening? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's butterfly sauce. Butterscotch! Come on, Flint, we're talking dessert barge here! Lockwood! You better be engaging in some solid note takering. Yes, Mr. Earl. Cal, that is a textbook example of a rule breaking shenaniganizer. <laughs> Aha! Tuning fork, gum, a wadded up piece of paper equals the Flint Lockwood butterfly attraction system. It's working! Come here, little fella. Uh-oh. The tiny lights are getting in my eyes! Hey! Hey! <laughs> I hate those freaky butterflies! My beautiful face! Flintlock Wood! Why is my precious cow's adorable face covered by this flicking and wing of their monsters? They have so much to teach us! Your inventionizing is playing this cool for a fool. That's not cool. I call Ruckus! What? Ruckus? <laughs> Come on! A ruckus? What's a ruckus? Read my lips. No more inventing! I just don't know what to do if I'm not inventing. Has life always been this dull? I am floating on a canoe of despair down a river of sadness. Wait, I know what I should do. Take a break from this whole conundrum and go with me to the dessert barge? I need to invent Mr. Earl something really special. They have unlimited sundae toppings. Something with a lot of... Strawberries, sprinkles, assorted crunchies. Something that'll be a real... And those little mini chocolate balls that when you bite them, they just blast! There's a ruckus coming, and I need to smell the intel. Flint Lockwood won't spill, but that other one whose name rounds with the jam, maybe she's a talker. Get ready, Cannery High. Earl Devereaux is about to go deep undercover. <laughs> Mmm, cherries, mmm, mmm. Ooh, those little tiny oranges. Flint Lockwood is getting ready for some major ruckus. I can sense it. My chest hairs like a wheat field in a windstorm. Ooh, maraschino oranges. Permission to counter ruckus, sir. To stop Flint Lockwood, I need to go deep undercover. Infiltrate the school disguised as a student. A Japanese tart. Earl Devereaux was going to transform himself into a new student. Smart as a whip. Whipped cream! My pretty hands are peach. Peaches! Hey, new girl. Back off, baby man. Ah! Yeah, she likes me. Oh. He wants ruckus? I'll show him ruckus. A ruckus like he's never seen before. The best kind of ruckus. A super oh, mega ruckus. Don't worry, Flint. It'll all smooth over. You know what else smooths over? Caramel fudge sauce. Caramel fudge sauce? Someone talking dessert barge? Whoa, you're tall. Are those schematics for an invention? I just love inventions. <laughs> love them. No, this is um uh, a giant recipe for something I've cooked up. Yeah, totally. <clears throat> Hello, the name's Pearl. I'm new. Oh, I'm new too. I'm Sam. I knew it round with ham. I'm, I mean, hey, why don't we go and chat about girl things like rap? 
rustling in that boy in that band sure is cute and what Flintlock Woods really up to. Hey, Sassy, I'm Mr. Classy. It's plain to see. Will you go to prom with me? Whoa! Ah! Now come along and tell little old Pearl everything you know about that shenanigan loving Flintlock Woods. And for the color of your nails, licorice fog or eggplant whispers. Licorice fog, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Let's play a game. We each tell a secret about a boy we know. Me first. The boy I know is a precious little angel named Cal. How? He just loves his daddy cuddles. Everyone loves daddy cuddles. Bride of conversation. Your time. He wants ruckus. I'll show him ruckus. A ruckus. Tell me about. Oh, I don't know. Flint Lockwood. Flint? <laughs> well, um, he's got crazy hair. He's smart and funny and... Hey, what? What? Uh, uh, more! Dobby! Flint would never get a manicure with me. I love this color. Yes, the nail is the canvas for the finger. have a girlfriend I can do fun things with. Like, go to the dessert barge, finally? Yeah, yeah. So, what do you think your friend Flint Lockwood is inventing now? Oh, well, Flint doesn't like me talking about his inventions until they're ready. But, it's going to be a... Uh... I knew it. An on-school property, too. Has he ever mentioned the word rocket? Silencio! You should be able to hear the sound of your bones cracking. Man! You're mm. right, Steve. Once the man gets a taste of what we're cooking up, there will be such a ruckus. I mean, a tasty meal. Excuse me! I have to pass with! Oops! <laughs> she smells as good as she looks. Hey! Hey! Then Lockwood's latest ruckus is gonna break a rule. I know it is. Only question is, which one? Pearl Devereaux always gets her man. Ooh, I don't feel well. <sighs> Principal Selburn, we're talking big pain. Don't I know it. My tummy's killing me. I don't want to betray my new best friend whose name rhymes with lamb. But Flint Lockwood is rustling up a big plate of ruckus. Am I an old friend to the law or a new friend to the girl? You're right. I'm being too soft. Rules must prevail. There's just something I have to do first. So, Kay, Kay, so tell me 10 secret things Pearl loves so I can pretend I love them too, so she'll like me. No, I would never betray a friend like that. What's your face is so loyal. Hey, babe, check out the pearls. We have the same necklace on. We have a lot in common. Ah! Sam, I need to tell you something. Uh, let's see. Uh, my family is moving. What? But, 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 but you just got here. You can't go. We're friends. Sorry, Sam. Bring it in. Mm. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, uh, Ooh, can't breathe, can't breathe. <laughs> we'll always have licorice fog. <laughs> Bye. She was the best one day friend I ever had. She was the best one day almost girlfriend I ever had. And now she's gone. <gasps> so long, dessert barge. See you in another seven years. Unless my family moves again. I wanted to give this to Pearl, but now that she's gone, you could have it. Hmm. Flint Lockwood, come out from behind that curtain. You are up to no good ruckus in. Just in time, Mr. Earl. I made you something extra special. Space Ruckerson with Cal! Get ready for the big... No! It's a playground? 
I wanted to do something nice to show you that not all inventions are ruckusy. It runs on butterflies? But that's just the propulsion system. The motor is actually... Butterscotch! Yeah! And the cables are... Licorice! And the dials are solid chocolate! I'm sorry you missed the dessert barge. I figured the only thing better would be a... dessert playground? You like? Oh, yeah! I love! <gasps> actually, that part's reinforced steel. It's delicious! Quick luck, Wood! I miss dust you. This time, ruckus averted. Rocket sweets for all! Rocket sweets! Rocket sweets! Give me more sweets! I need sweets! Give me the sweets! I need sweets! I'm 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 Definition of photosynthesis. Oh, 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 oh! I got this one, Mr. E. Okay, photosynthesis. The process by which my posterior is replicated in tasteful black and white. That is a photocopy. And a very upsetting one at that. Can anyone else enlighten us? Photosynthesis is when plants use sunlight to synthesize food from carbon dioxide and water, thus creating energy to grow and live. <laughs> nerd, 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 nerd alarm. You two are so the samesies. Samesies? Shh. We're completely different. Jinx, double jinx, triple jinx, quadruple jinx, infinity jinx. I bet even when you synchronize swim, you do the exact same thing when you're swimming. Of course we do. That's supposed to be samesies. And just feet. Samesies, 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 samesies. We're, We're not. not. Samesies, we'll prove it. Samesies. <laughs> Total samesies. Samesies, samesies. We, we have, have to, to prove, prove we're not samesies. samesies. This will show everyone how different I am. A Flint Lockwood sandwich extravaganza. Only I, Master Flintmeister, has the vision for this expression of the sandwich art. Truly one of a kind. Stop copying me. You're the one copying me. But joke's on you. I'm uncopyable. As per example, I think I'll add a little pre-chewed gum. Hey, there was still flavor juice in that. Mm -mm. Mm, I'd like to see you copy that. Oh, well, I like mine with lots of expired milk. So good. Sour, chunky milk. Mm, how about some stinky socks? Dirt clump. Oh, some hair from the drain. Baby diaper gunk. Horse hoof shaving. Oh, worm guts. Well, aren't you going to eat yours? <laughs> after, after, after you. After you. After you. <laughs> mm, these are delicious. Is there more? <sighs> no yak attacks on school property. <laughs> you two are so the samesies. We are not. I bet I have more in common with the... the... Brent! And I have more in common with... Uh, um... <sighs> Fine. Gil. I knew you'd pick me! Oh, yes, me, not others. Me! <laughs> Indeed. So what do I get for pretending to like you, Loch Nerdicus? I've got some leftover pizza in my lab. Yeah! Bring it in! <laughs> Best bros for life! Dude, this is the coolest doctor's office I've ever been in, and I even haven't had to do anything in a cup yet. It's a lab. Or is it a spaceship? It's a lab. <laughs> I bet it's a lab inside a spaceship. It's just a lab. Run by robots. No. Beep, boop, no. I am Brent, but... No. 
Robots don't sound like that. They do. And it's a lab. And be careful with your butt. You're knocking stuff over. I call this tie Mr. Blue. And this dapper fellow is Mr. Paisley. And guess who this is? <sighs> Mr. Green. Actually, it's Madame Chartreuse. But close enough. Oh, it's like we share the same brain. Poor heart. Okay. Well, look at that. According to my non-existent watch, it's time to go. But Sammy Samson. Don't you want to see my collection of high-end government-funded weather devices? What do you know? My wrist is fast. I'd love to see them. So if this is a spaceship... It's not. It is. Where are all the probes? There aren't any. Is this a probe? No, that's a table. If this was a probe, would it look like this? If I said, here's a probe, would that be it? That's a blowtorch. Ugh, this space station is lame. <sighs> I gotta give time to... Hey, that looks like fun. Is that book science? That, you're just banging your head. If I do this with this, someone come in and say he's doing science. Yes. <laughs> Is that a nuclear-powered umbrella? With room for two. Wireless temperate gauge ice cream maker? <laughs> Sammy Sam Sam, do you want to share a BFF Sunday? Stop that, Gil! Hey, Flip, you know, with all this stuff you got, you should invent something. Like, you should ever thought of doing that? That's what I do! Oh, me too, Flockwood! Look at this baby! Shirt plate! Just came up with that. And a tornado tracker with cow shielding? Where did you get it? Daddy has his ways. Embezzlement, kickbacks, <laughs> bribery, closed circuit TV. Sometimes he stands in a closet and listens. Oh, okay, right. Oh, no! These ropes on this weather balloon are listening! Okay, see you later! I'll send you Sammy Sam Sam! Sammy Sam Sam! Hey, son. Hey, Sam. Sam's not with me, Dad. Really? You two are closer than two sardines, hand-packed in a can filled with premium-grade olive oil. Maybe a little garlic and a little parsley on top, and then maybe put on a cracker. Mmm, there's nothing like it. I... What were we talking about? Everyone was teasing Sam and me for being all the samesies, and we had this fight, and now I'm best friends with Brent, and I think I made a horrible mistake! Hey, nerd face, where do you keep your bang-bang powder? You know, to make things go go-go? Hey, you guys got any pizza in the can? Did I just invent that? Another one for Brent! To the spaceship! Yeah, you've made a horrible mistake. <laughs> that was a close one, Sammy Sam Sam. But I saved you. Yeah, great, thanks. You almost missed out on one more surprise. <laughs> Are those real toenails? Amazing, I know. Full disclosure, they're not all mine. <sighs> I miss Flint. <sighs> I miss Sam. But not you, Sammy Sam Sam. Up! I don't feel very up, Steve. This is gonna make me even more famous than I already am. The first rocket ever sent into space. Brent, a lot of scientists have already sent rockets into space. That just means we're gonna have to smash it extra hard so it'll go back in time and take off before all those other loser rockets. Brent, hitting something hard doesn't send it back in time. Yeah, it does. <laughs> wow! Look at me! I don't even... <laughs> Well, of course I'll be your BFF. What? No! Let's just go back. We're never going back relationship-wise. You want to know why? I really don't. 
A lot of kids befriend me for my stuff. My toenail collection, my weather balloon. But not you, Sammy Sam Sam. You're special. Oh, <laughs> me? No, no, not special at all. Normal old Sammy Sam Sam. Yep, that's me. So modest. I'm glad you and Flint aren't friends anymore. What? Flint and I are still friends. At least I hope we are. But we have so much in common. Okay, look, Gil. We've got about as much in common as a hammer and a rocket. <gasps> I told you not to hit the rocket with the hammer! Trust the science, Flipwood! <laughs> Are you all right? Sorry if I ruined your fun. Fun? What fun? I was with Gil. Lucky you. I was with Brent. Do you know he hammers fuel tanks to get them to travel back in time? Oh, Gil collects toenails. <coughs> I'm right, right here. here. I'll have you know, toenail collecting is considered a classic hobby. Yeah. I have a toenail collection and it's won awards. You do? Yeah. Dude, I've got like ten. <gasps> Can I touch them? Depends. Got any probes? Uh, like my dad's mare, we have rooms piled high with probes. Cool. <laughs> I also have 98% body fat. They're, They're going, going to be good friends. friends. Jinx! Jinxy Jinx! Mr. Jinx's Jinx Parade! Pineapple Skateboard Banana Jinx! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.